Greetings and salutations, I'm Kev. Welcome back to this Let's Play of EU4 as Hungary. So we are in a war not quite over choosing, but that's okay. So far it's not going terribly bad. Only slightly bad. If this one actually falls, then we're good. If the forts start falling, we are going to be good. Of course, Memmingen is sieging a fort they can't possibly defeat. And they're running amok inside my in heartland, so they're going to cause a whole bunch of devastation. Lovely. But I want at least one fort fall to fall. Then we can go and deal with this mess. And they're doing exactly what we expected. Oh, we're going to go in here, spread out, cause uh, devastation. That's the downside. If I had a fort here, we could have prevented that. Uh, but I th figured, nah, I'm not going to be at, at war from that edge. Of course we are. All the time. Ugh. The AI is very good at this. And I hate the AI for it. They suck at negotiating uh, passage throughout the, the entire continent. They're great at sending in forces and sp spreading out like this. And causing devastation. And you need so many blasted forts in order to prevent that. It's insane how many forts you need. So now we're in a fort race. Uh, fort race. Size zero. Okay, we should hopefully have this one fall first. 0% chance to 0% chance. Damn it. This one is about to fall. Which is good. He might go up and actually get the capital down. Uh, where's Memmingen? Oh, Ma Ma there we go, Magdeburg. There you are. You're also in this mess. We still have a truce with the Ottomans, right? Yes, we do. Uh, have more countries converted yet? No, still just one center of information. So I gotta hope that this war is gonna end quickly. Moreover, I have to hope that we aren't going to be dragged into more wars. You have a 14% chance already! Oh god, your cap oh, capital is going to go down. Um, I can't stop this now. Damn it. I'm going to lose my capital. Run back to our capital. Pest must be saved. Run, 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 run. Are we going to get that in time? 29% chance. They're definitely going to have at least one roll before we get there. At least one roll. Probably two. So one in three chance it's going to fall. About. And it didn't fall. Excellent. Whew. That was close. Of course now you're going to fight a much worse battle. I hope Bavaria is close by. You're coming in. You will, you will reinforce I hope. Yes you are going to reinforce. Excellent. So even though we're going to get a crossing penalty, should be fine. Oh, of course our leader died on the first bloody day of the battle. Oh, that was not nice. Let's see if we can intercept the Magdeburgian forces. And they finally abandoned the seed there. Good for them. You're running away, so I can't actually do anything. Uh, in that case... We're going to split our forces. And on siege this. They're going to have to give us something. We simply have too much participation at this point. Uh, do we have favors to buy anything here? Mm, no, 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 and... Hell no. Still, we'll live with it. Since he got that 25% malice, of course he's gonna live until he's 105 or something. It's insane. <laughs> then again, he's a good king, so I suppose we have to serve, have to accept it. He is a good king. Are you in a war now? You're moving your troops. I don't... I, that worries me. Okay, that one's done. Move up. 
lost the claim on Vienna. Yeah, we need to start fabricating claims again. That's gonna be next. You're trying to siege both forts. Farmland forts. We are under strength. Where are you? All the way up there. Um, hell with the prestige. If we if we um, if we decide, can I go to that? I can. Okay. If we decide to convert, we're gonna lose all our prestige anyway, aren't we? So. Right. Uh, lose a hundred prestige. Yeah. So we're gonna we're gonna attack no matter what. Foreign quarter of Buddha. I don't really. What? what? Do these stack? They do not stack. Okay, so it was the same event. But now we don't have the other option, so we are gonna burn Alsace. Alsace, who cares? Local trade power sounds great. Did you add a. Yeah, local trade strength. It's 1510, and the institution is apparently not gonna spawn before then. Boo! It's really hoping we would have a very cheap development cost, but apparently not. So there are more forces here than we can fight, really. But he's gonna lose the forts if we don't, so... Gonna have to try. I need this war to end. Anyone else converted yet? No. Still only Lindenberg. Oh, he's gonna run away. Good. That, that's all I wanted. If he's going away, that's fine. Because that's gonna reset the siege. Um, he's not running away. In that case, let's try to kill this. Okay, now he's gonna go up there try to reinforce this. That's fine. Uh, hopefully we can do some damage before he arrives. It's a 1-1 one, versus one our 4-5. I'd like to think that would do it. Oh, that was great. Stack wipe. Uh, if you're still insisting on going here, we'll show you the error of your ways. Oh. Yeah, those nobles. That's kind of annoying. There we go. And he can't rebuild, so that's glorious. Uh, so now I guess we go over here and try to kill the remainder of their army. And point capped. Um, fine. So that's a hundred extra points we have to pay. That hurts. Stupid magnets. But we got an extra diplomat, and he's gonna be sent. Do you know what? Support there. It is so unlikely that we can win this battle. I mean, Austria is at 21. Brandenburg at 20. Nah. As long as they're interested, it's not gonna happen. We're better served trying to destroy Austria and Brandenburg, and then we can... <laughs> if Poland still has an elective thing. We can go after them. You're gonna... Move your forces back, okay. Go to Brno then. All that, and I'll we'll start occupying more land. I'm not gonna charge this stack. And if he wants to fight up there, that's fine. Bohemia is dead. I just need Bohemia to die. <laughs> For lack of a better word. Uh, yeah, I, I think I still wanna keep my stack together. It's moving so slowly. 
We probably want to recruit more leaders. What's our army tradition like? Yeah, 60. I think we can get something good from that. Between 5 and 13 pips. That's a lot of maneuver. Uh, production stifled. Gee, inflation isn't the worst thing. Could have paid on inflation, actually. Um, but I'll take the production. It's, it's okay. You're back here again. Won't give up, huh? Well, you do that then. I'm gonna occupy all your provinces in the meantime. Noble birth. Okay, so what this time? <sighs> Loyalty from the nobles and the burghers are gonna get super pissed. Or the nobles are gonna get super pissed and the burghers are gonna be happy. Yeah, we have to do this. I cannot let the nobles get more... more stuffs. And I can't make them happy, so fine. Cannot commit to such a promise. And so now you're very happy. Do I want to steal your money? The development cost is nice. But right now we can't really get anything out of it. I'll take your money. I mean, it looks like that bloody institution isn't gonna spawn. Urgh. It's an eight years late now. Because Portugal is messing around in Africa, probably. They're not actually uh, pursuing anything sensible. Okay, Magdeburg should go out of this war fairly soon. We actually have unrest. Wow, okay. Okay, split. Start sieging down things. We are not going to spend points anymore. Okay, you decide to sit there. Fine, I'm going to go here then. I want to lessen their ability to retreat. That's why we're taking over the provinces. First. Yes, I know the nobles are unhappy. They're very unhappy. Not much I can do, but there we go. Well, actually, that's just Magdeburg. Okay, fine. And they pick the other ducats. We'll get 200 ducats of that. Excellent, thank you. Oh, you're actually going there, too. Fine, I guess we'll try to... Uh, gather up. Finally, colonialism spawns. Took you long enough, Portugal. It must have been Portugal, right? Can't have been anyone but Portugal. There we go, finally. So now there's a point in actually developing. Um, getting both of those texts would be awesome too. Getting more of this would be great. Uh, it's just a, a stupid Magyar thing. Come on! 65. Die, please die. <laughs> uh, on the other hand, we are on par with mill tech, so there's no point in saving the mill points. So I can definitely use those. Uh, can I switch policies? I probably should. To development cost thingy bob. There we go. Courage development. Please do. That's not my... 13 points. 13 points. Oh boy. Yeah, um... But I want to spend all the other points first, so... We're not gonna spend the diplomatic points. How much would it cost to core these? 40... 50... I don't know how much it's gonna give us, if anything. He might get us in trouble, for all I know. Might very well get us in trouble. But yeah, um. I 
So I, I do want to spend a few points on dip here too. Because it's a center of trade, right? So I'll start with those. Eight, then some of that. How's the colonialism? Pulling it over rather quickly. That's it for development in uh, that for now. Ten. This cost is going up. Can't do that anymore because of uh, it's a mill points. I'm gonna do this. It's insane. Of course, oh no, I can't do that because I need to invest. Uh, I don't have enough points now. Colonialism is present, so we did what we wanted set out to do. 37 development. Took advantage of the modifiers. Grew to an insane size. I could do that too. But at this point I think we're I think we're okay. I'm gonna wait for the next institution. So we have colonialism, at least present. I mean we can't really actually, you know. Take it in yet. But that does mean it's going to spread here, to the neighboring provinces. Not fast. But it's going to get there. And if I start developing more, which I could, like in this province here, which it still has the... Mm. Tempted. Of course, doing this means that, yeah, it would have been nice to convert first and then start developing, but... Mm. What can you do, right? Okay, I should probably go and try to stop this. Rather than help them up there. I don't really want to fight this one. Not as long as I don't control the war. If I controlled this war, I would have like, liked to attack that too. Corruption is almost gone. Excellent. It's actually at a level where I don't really care about rooting out corruption anymore. So let's stop doing that. Point zero zero six. We're gonna get more. Uh, group up, please. Thank you. And move this way. Fantastic. Let's try not to attrition too much. Still want to preserve manpower whenever possible. How's our mission going? We're almost done. So Bavaria, feel free to wait until Milan is. At 100. Then we can make peace. I'm kind of terrified what might happen here. Yeah, he's gonna run away. Because he knows we're coming close. Uh, one more month. Then we're going to complete our mission. Excellent. Next up. Uh, yeah, I want to do that. I want to do that. And da -da -da -da. Force limit is pretty high though, so that would mean 30 troops. So protect against Venice first, I guess. Yeah, that requires 3 troops. What's our current combat with 25 so I guess we're gonna recruit four more infantry and that should be sufficient for that mission I no longer need to butter up to you uh, yeah that's gonna be a defeat I don't care Not really. I want to finish this before I turn my attention up there. 
But yeah, Bavaria, you should feel free to make peace now. You can't really get much more. You really can't. Because they are very much toast. Hold the line, we're coming to save you, but probably not fast enough. So feel free to end this war whenever possible. Feel free to end the war. Uh, build a spine to on Venice, sure. Oh! Uh, Bohemia is gonna win. Or, no? Allies won, and that means we're gonna destroy him right there. Because he can't retreat any further. There we go. Oh, good lord, what happened? Um. Sixteen favors. Bohemia will cede Pleasant, Sheb, and Hornifarsh to Bavaria. Bohemia will cede Olmush to Hungary. Okay. Bohemia will release Silesia as a sovereign state. So you gave us one province and took three for yourself. Well. I'm okay with this. Uh, are you an HRE state? Yes, you are. So, first of all, not gonna mark these anymore. Gonna mark that though because it's the same state. Right? Yeah. Excellent. Richie, return home, please. Thank you. And core the one thing we did get. So we got something out of it. We got a bit of money too, and we got lots of favors, which, gonna, which we are going to buy up right away. Conquered Almatia is a nice mission. Protect our brethren. In Avlon. That's against... Uh, Wait, what? Oh, down there. Okay, so it is against the Ottomans. Um, which would be fine too. I'll create a proper fleet. But... We have another decision to make first. To go Protestant or to stay home? <laughs> um... True faith and heretics. We're gonna have a lot of heretics. Actually, we're gonna have a lot of heathens. No, these are heretics. They're orthodox. Okay. Please say Pesht. Uh, Center information will appear in a European province. Okay. So I can't control where, but imagine if it was Pest. That would be fantastic. Gonna lose 100 prestige. So all our prestige says poof. Which is fine, I don't care about that at all. And of course, we are gonna be Protestant, which is gonna piss off a whole bunch of people. We're gonna lose the Heretical Combinero Act. And the problem with that is that that's gonna weaken our uh, conversion strength. And these require admin 8, right? Yes. Uh, so our conversion strength isn't going to be that great. Even though we get that plus 10 modifier. Um. <laughs> so do we want to do it? It's going to be the better religion. That's why I'm interested in it. Um, but we're going to need to ask one people, people favor first anyways. That would have mattered if we were still gonna fight the for the um, Polish throne, but we're not really gonna, are we? I think I'm more interested in this. That's the one thing I know we're gonna get get permanently. 
I'm not sure if, if the uh, over time blessings like this. I don't know if they're going to be removed because I'm no longer Catholic. So I'll take the one more Catholicism. And then I have to sit back and think, think about this for a second. Um, I don't think our alliances will break. But they'll certainly think twice about a lot of things here. And of course our religious unity is going to go down the toilet. Uh, we're going to have revolts everywhere. It's gonna be lively. On the other hand, we might as well. Uh, we're saving up money for the institution anyways. So we can actually embrace that pretty quickly. And we're gonna do that before the next tech up. Which isn't gonna be for a long time anyways, because we're out of points. I might... Do I want to keep investing? Kind of interested. Kind of interested in investing more. And since we took economic ideas, we can, can, can kind of do that. Still. No, I'm going to take a break here. I'm going to think about converting to Protestantism or not. If we did, we can get embraced the institution right away. We, could, we would have enough money. So there's that. Mm. And besides, that one province up here did cause a bit more aggressive expansion, so we have time. And we have time. Time for a break too. Thank you for watching.